that worked out pretty good. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna set you on this stand. We talked about that whole hands-free law. And I'm gonna just turn this. Oops, it's focusing on me. Here we go. I'm gonna turn it. Try to get a shot of us going down the road here. Let's see how that works. We're playing with Eric Jordan's uh, little clamp on camera device here too. Car feels great. I got a broken door handle over there. I need to fix that. And uh, I like to wash all the windows real good. Um, I've got one of those new trick starters, like a, like a, like you can get nowadays. A little small one with the three and a half horse, you know, high high torque thing on it. Uh, I'm thinking about putting it on here, but I'm not in a hurry to do that. Kind of like for to get the motor a quick little spin when it cranks. I like that. I like it a lot. I like the sound of it. You saw the checker. Tire pressure on the front tire, too, on this. I might swap them other tires, put them on here, and just see how they feel. Although, I like the way these feel. They might actually look a little better too, bigger tire. Let's see. Let's see what they I hooked up a little bit, I can see it there, but it's got a safety latch on it, so hopefully it shouldn't pop up. I won't go real fast on the way home. We got to go to Hartwell today, so I don't have the whole day to play with the car. I will have tomorrow to play with it before we go to the show. I mean, uh, you know, show Saturday, March, Friday. <laughs> I got to go to a physical therapist. Basically, I just want to get permission to do what I want to do with my leg. Not be bothered about it. You know, I, don't, I think a lot of times that physical therapy is just wasting time and money. I don't want to be doing something that's not going to be good for me, you know, find out later. I can say, oh, what you do that for? You're not messing all up, you know. And they start talking about giving you a new knee. I don't want no new knee. I like to keep the one I got for as long as I can. Although it is a pretty miraculous thing. Think about it, that people get new knees nowadays. It's like, oh, who'd have ever thought? Like when I was a kid, that people be cutting out Cutting out whole body parts and bones and things, looking back. It's pretty amazing the world we're living in. Back when I was a kid, you know, stick a thermometer in your mouth, wrap a towel around the head, and hear everybody pray for you, because that's about all they had, you know. Much more than that. I got a uh, thermometer, I got a speedometer in my phone, but I don't think it works. One of those things you have to update all the time to get it to work. But I can, I can compare the speedometer in my phone to the speedometer on the dash to help get a clear idea of how fast I'm actually going. I might do that later, later on down the road here somewhere. I'm thinking about replacing my turn signal. This has a turn signal that's built into the column and it's pretty old. Well, it's as old as the car. It's uh, somewhat worn out. And uh, I was thinking about putting one of them Toyota Prius steering columns in here and I thought, well, maybe I could get all the electronics out of that. But right now I'm kind of thinking about not doing that and spending my money on some other thing. But one of the things I, I know I could do is you can buy a little aftermarket turn signal switch and put on, on your steering column and uh, you know if I had one of them I'd always know for sure if my blinker is blinking because as it is I'm never sure sometimes the light on the dash will flash and sometimes it won't you know find out you've been going down the road with your turn signal on it always looks I always look kind of trashy you know to me a little bit so better if I can eliminate that Little turn signal switches don't cost very much. You just have to be, you don't know how to get your wiring, get your wiring sorter, sorter, sorted out so you can run everything to where you want it to go. Hold the door. I like the way she's driving and 
running real good. Be nice to put that door handle on this today, maybe. He might make me some deviled eggs. My buddy gave me some duck eggs. Duck eggs make some good deviled eggs. I think. So how was that, Charlie? A good ride for you? Yeah. You went with Daddy in the hot rod, didn't you, buddy? Ooh, the joy. Here you go, I'll help you out. Just climb right up on top of me here and we'll get you out of this thing. What you want? Come get y'all out too. 